Project management is the discipline that helps in organizing and managing the objective of a project in a controlled manner to produce unique outcomes. In today's market, project manager is recognized as one of the most reputed profession and offers a very attractive salary. Also, the demand for a skilled project manager is growing throughout the world. With this said, I think it is a good time to start a career as a project management. Hey guys, this is Aman from Edureka and I welcome you all to this interesting session on project manager career path. But before we get started, I would like to address the agenda for today's session. So firstly, we'll understand who is a project manager and what are their roles and responsibilities. Next, we'll understand what are the skills required to build a career as a project manager. Moving on, we'll take a look at the market trend and salary of a project manager. And finally, we will conclude the session by knowing what are the different careers in project management. Now, moving on to our first topic, who is a project manager? Well, a project manager is a professional who is responsible for leading a project from the very beginning to the very end. They are responsible for driving a project through various phases of project management in a controlled manner. Now, the various phases of project management includes planning, executing, monitoring, controlling, and closing the projects. They are responsible for the entire project scope, the project team management, risk estimation, and the various resources needed for the project. Also, the project manager are the go-to person in case of any difficulty or doubt regarding the project. They not only communicate with the project team or the internal resources, but also deal with clients, stakeholders, as well as any external resources involved in the project. Now, a project manager can work in various industries. So it is up to your interest and skill set in which field you want to work. You can work as a project manager in the IT field, healthcare, education, industrial, finance, and many more fields. But some of the fields in which project managers are in very high demands are healthcare, construction, and the IT industry. So now let us talk about some of the roles and responsibilities of a project manager. Now again, project manager working in different fields will have different roles and responsibility. Like a project manager role in the IT industry will be quite different from the role of a project manager in the construction field. But we have penned out few of the common roles and responsibilities of a project manager. So the first responsibility is, is responsible for planning a project management plan. Next, you need to ensure timely completion of a project within the given budget. Following that, they should ensure that all the resources are available and allocated that are needed for the project. They should also organize and motivate the project team in order to achieve the end goals. Next, they have to communicate with the internal resources and the stakeholders for the smooth functioning of the project. They have to also monitor the progress and resolve any problem that might occur during the project. Following that, they have to analyze the risk and take measures to avoid all the risk. And then measure the project performance using appropriate system, tools, techniques, and make a report or document all of this performance evaluation. So these are some of the common roles and responsibility of a project manager. Now let us move on to the next topic and see what are the market trends and job salary for a project manager. Now as per the project management job growth and talent gap report by PMI, it is predicted that over the next decade, Organization of all the sizes and type will require approximately 88 million people working in different project management roles. So with this said, let us see some of the job openings for a project manager in India and the United States. So according to Glassdoor, there are more than 3,300 job openings for a project manager in India, with Bangalore having the highest of 717 job openings. And in the United States, there are more than 55,400 job openings for a project manager. Now this was the number only from one website. There are many more job opportunities around you. Also, the demand for a skilled project manager is growing and so is the salary. Let us now take a look at the salaries for a project manager. So according to Glassdoor, the average salary for a project manager in India is 15 lakhs per annum. And the average salary for a project manager in the United States is $87,560 per annum. Now the salary can vary depending on your experience, the place and the company you're working for. This was just a number for a project manager with good years of experience. As a fresher in India, you can expect your salary to be around 4 to 6 lakhs, but as your experience increases, your salary also will increase. So this was about the market trend and salary of a project manager. Let us move on to the next topic and see what are the skills required to become a project manager. The first skill is communication skill. Now as a project manager, you will have to work closely with the stakeholders, team members and a lot of people from different departments. So communication is the key to manage all these people. You will have to communicate with the stakeholders and the higher authority to clearly explain the progress you're making with the project. You will also have to communicate with your team members and your subordinates and explain them what are the goals of the project and assign them their individual tasks. Now all these tasks requires you to have strong communication skill to be able to convey all your messages to the client and your team members. Project manager needs the skill to effectively share the vision, goals, ideas and issues. 
They also need communication skills to produce presentation and reports to the higher authority. And according to PMI's 2018 Pulse of Professional report found that communication was a primary factor in 29% of the failed projects. So you see how important it is to have good communication skill. So this was the first and the prominent skill required to become a project manager. Now here I'm just going to talk about a few general skills a project manager should have, not technical skills. So the next skill is leadership skill. Now as a project manager, you'll be managing a team. You will have to assign each of the individual with the individual task, have to get updates from them. You have to also motivate your team members and get the work done. So having a strong leadership skills are very important for a project manager. Now this skill is not something you can learn in a day or a week. It grows as you develop your project management experience. Also, there is no particular way to define what is the best leadership type. Each project manager will have his or own way of managing a team. But a good leader not only coordinates the task, but also motivates and encourages the team members to do their task and defines the roadmap to successfully complete the project. So you can develop a skill by actually watching someone who you think has good leadership skills and learning from their actions and decisions. So this was the second important skill you need to become a project manager. The next skill is team management. Now this skill is closely related to the previous one. As a project manager, you're not only responsible for keeping yourself organized, but also have to assign and manage the task of your team members and subordinates. A project manager must be able to bring the whole team together and make sure all are on the same page, aligning the personal goals with those of the organization. Team management skills include the ability to delegate responsibilities, evaluate performance, handle all the conflicts that are happening in the team, and teach your team members to help them improve the skills. Also, the project manager should ensure that the team members finish the given task within the given deadlines. So you see, team management is also a very important skill for becoming a project manager. Now moving on to our next skill required to become a project manager, which is negotiation skill. Now one of the responsibility of a project manager is to review the budget each day to ensure the project does not exist the resource allocation. This may also include processing and approving invoices for many third party vendors. So it is very important to negotiate with the third party vendors to make sure that you're getting the required product at a good deal. Having good negotiation skill contributes significantly to business success as they help you build better relationship, deliver lasting quality solution rather than poor short term solution that do not satisfy the needs of either party. They also help you avoid future problem and conflicts. So for having good negotiation skill, you should focus on the ultimate goal for the negotiation and focus on solving the problem to benefit both the side of the issues. Again, to have good negotiation skill, you should have good communication skills. So you see all of this are interrelated. Now moving on to a next skill required to become a project manager, which is personal organization. Now a project manager should have good organization skills. They should have to ensure all the processes go as planned and are in line with the common goals set by the company. Personal organization includes the ability to multitask, then they should prioritize the tasks. This is very important because there could be tasks which will start only after a particular task end. So it is very important to organize and prioritize the task and all these processes should be documented for easy access and further references. Now personal organization skill also includes interpersonal skills, which includes self-confidence, relationship management and collaboration skill. Project managers should collaborate well as a part of a team, which would allow the entire team to work together so they can be more productive and complete the project more efficiently. Relationship management skills are also essential as they enable the project manager to develop and nurture relationship with the clients and also with the vendors and team members. Also, the right level of self-confidence can also improve the confidence of a team as a whole, increasing morale and allowing for improved performance. And finally, the next skill required to become a project manager is risk management. Now, risks are inevitable. They will be present in every project. So as a project manager, it will be your responsibility to identify the risk beforehand and find solutions for it. The project manager should follow the five important steps in risk planning, which is identifying the risk, analyzing the risk, prioritizing the risk, treating the risk, and then monitoring and reviewing the risk. Project managers should also know how to use professional risk management tools that will allow them to analyze potential risks to develop risk mitigation strategies. So managing risk is a very integral part of a project and handling this is one of the core responsibilities of a project manager. Now this skill also improves with experience. So these were some of the important skills required to become a project manager. Now let us move on to our next topic, which is the main topic and see the careers in project management. Now here first we have the project coordinator. The project coordinator is the entry level administrator project management job role. They're very important and work under a project manager to ensure the project are completed on time and within the budget. So they're responsible for overseeing small parts of the larger projects with a primary responsible for administrative tasks. 
They have to work with various members of the project team and the clients to use Spreadsheet to track budgets, dates, and other information. A project coordinator job description often includes organizing contracts, financial files, reports, and invoices, and performing all the administrative duties such as ordering office supplies, bookkeeping, and billing. So this was about project coordinator. Second, we have project manager. We have discussed about project manager in details in the first topic. The professionals who are responsible for leading a project from the very beginning to the very end. A project manager oversees the entire project, including budgets, plans, schedules, and the project demonstration. You also make sure that the project runs properly and is completed on time and within the given budget. After the project manager, we have program manager. Now program manager is a professional who handles many programs. Now program can be defined as a group of projects managed in a coordinated way to ensure the value is achieved. A program manager is responsible for coordinating multiple projects and then rejoining them according to the interdependencies among them. They have a high level view of the entire program and they strategically guide the project managers to ensure they're all working effectively towards the program's objective. The Project Management Institute describes the role of program manager as a super project manager who strategically directs all the program's interconnected projects simultaneously. Their roles and responsibilities are almost the same as that of a project manager, but at a larger scale. Where a project manager takes care of one project, process manager handles various projects together. The next job role is Senior Project Manager. A senior project manager is a more experienced project manager. So they are entrusted with a bigger and more complex project. Now the exact job role and responsibilities of a senior project manager varies companies to company, but they have additional responsibility with respect to the junior project manager. Also high priority projects are given to senior project managers as they are more experienced and skilled. They also guide the new project managers. In some organization, they are responsible for hiring new project managers. Now these were just a few roles and responsibilities of a senior project manager. Depending on the company, they might have additional responsibilities. So these were some of the careers in project management. And with this, we have come to the end of this video. I hope it was helpful. Do leave your valuable comments in the comment section below. Happy learning.